What's up, everyone? Back here with Doki Doki Literature Club, and we stopped at a pivotal moment last time, so we are definitely going to see uh, what's going to happen here. So, um, a couple of strange things happened last episode. We are now at this pivotal point where we always we will get to friend zone Sayori or tell her I love you. And seeing as all the work we put in to be with Sayori this long, of course I'm gonna say I love you. I love you. Eh. Those are my true feelings. So there is no way that you could like me more than I like you. I should have realized it sooner. But spending time with everyone at the club, making new friends, and having fun with you every day, it helped me realize that you are truly the most important person to me. And that's the truth! That's the truth, Sayori, and you should uh, you should acknowledge it. This is why I'll accept you and any of your burdens. As long as we continue like this every day, with you by my side, then I know we'll both be happy. Psych. Suddenly, Sayori wraps her arms tightly around me. Oh, look, she's so sad. Psych. Is this really okay? Yes. Yes, it is. And fuck Monica and whatever she said in spewing in your ear. God, I can't believe she'd say mean stuff to her. I hold Sayori in my arms and pull her closer. You'll never have to let go of me again. I love you, psych. I want to be with you forever. Yes, let's make it happen. Let's get married right now. I don't even know what my face looks like, but let's do it. Me too. I feel Sayori's grip around me weaken a little bit. What is this? Sayori. I'm supposed to be happy right now. I always thought this would be the happiest moment for me. But why? Even now? Why won't the rain clouds go away? It's part of you saying you had depression earlier. It's not just like it's gonna go away just like that, you know, but whatever. Why don't the rain clouds go away? They're not going away at all, Psyche. It's okay, Sayori. It's okay. It's natural. It might take some time for things to get better again. That's the truth. But no matter how long it takes, I'll be there every step of the way. That's all that matters right now. Oh, okay. I trust you. Sayori and I slowly release each other. So, I guess that makes the festival tomorrow our first date, huh? Hee hee hee. What are you saying? I don't want to think about those things, you know? I want everything to be the same as it's always been. Even if we really are a couple. Yeah, but it's not going to be the same because nothing, everything changes all the time. I don't know if I could handle anything more right now. It's really new and scary to me. I understand. You know what? You need a little bit of thinking time. That's okay. You'll be good. You'll be fine. Just just keep in touch. And we'll be fine. We'll go at a, whatever pace suits you best. Hey, psych. Sayori gazes at me once again, smiling sadly. Even if I get really, really sad, this is the best thing for me. Right? Eh? I don't really understand what Sayori means by that. Are you saying that this is making you feel sad, Sayori? I, I don't know. I don't understand what I'm feeling. I felt like a bunch of thorns when felt like a bunch of thorns when you told me you love me. But that's why I want to trust you. You know what's best for me. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I'm a psycho. And I know what's best. Trust me. I do. That's my promise. I say that, but in reality, I've never felt more uncertain when it comes to Sayori. I know I love her, and she loves me. But I'm having as much trouble understanding Sayori's feelings as she is. Even though I can comfort her, I keep wondering if I should be doing something more or something different. I know these thoughts will continue to plague me until things are back to the way they were. Is that what Sayori meant by not wanting anything to change? I don't know. But I know that I'll give it everything I've got. Sayori is the most important person to me, and I'll do whatever it takes to have a happy future with her. Ah, so sweet am I. Finally realizing that it was all right in front of you. It's the day of the festival. Of all days, I expected this to be the one where I'd be walking into school with Sayori. But Sayori isn't answering her phone. Well, why not? I considered going to her house to wake her up, but I decided that's a little too much. Why not? I mean, you're technically her boyfriend now. Go wake her up. 
Go get her out of bed early. I mean, I know she likes to sleep in, but get her out of bed early. Meanwhile, the preparations for the event should be nearly complete. The banner Yuri and I painted is dry, and I gently rolled it up to take it with me. She sent me a pleasant text reminding me not to forget anything, and I reassured her. I was like, yeah, sure. Funnily enough, I probably feel the same way as Natsuki about the event. I'm more excited for it to be over so I can spend time with Sayori and Yuri after the festival. Eh, more just Sayori. Yeah. I know, but knowing Monica, I'm sure the event will be great too. So wait, why didn't I, why couldn't I go get Sayori out of bed? I, I want, really wanted to do that. Was, this, there's no music. Psych, you're the first one here. Thanks for being early. That's funny. I thought at least Yuri would be here by now. Monica is placing little booklets on each of the desks in the classroom. They must be the one she prepared that has all the poems we're performing. In the end, I found a random poem online and thought Monica would like it and submitted it. So that's the one I'll be performing. I'm surprised you didn't bring Sayori with you. Yeah, she overslept again. That dummy. That dummy! She just, she just, she just rolled out her entire like emotional life to you yesterday. And you're like, that dummy. You think that on days important she'd try a little... Oh, no. Oh, no. What if, what if something's happened to Sayori? Oh, no. Oh, no. Suddenly I feel awful not knowing it's nearly not that simple for her. Yeah. I only said it because it's the way... It is. No. But maybe I should have gone to wake her up after all. Yeah, you should have, you fucking retard. Ah, ha, ha. You should take a little responsibility for her, psych. I mean, especially after your exchange with her yesterday. Kind of left her hanging this morning, you know? How do you know about this? Exchange? Monica, how do you know about that? Of course I do. I'm the club president, after all. Oh, that doesn't explain shit. But, I stammer, embarrassed. Did Sayori really tell her about it that quickly? That we're a couple now? I didn't really plan on bringing it up with anyone yet. Yeah, even Sayori wanted to say that everything was the same. How did you know? Were you spying on us? Are you really the cause of trouble? Jeez. You don't know the full story at all, so... Don't worry. I probably know a lot more than you think. Oh, that's creepy. Huh? Monica is being as friendly as usual. For some reason, I felt a chill down my spine after hearing that. Oh, why? Hey, do you want to check out the pamphlets? They came out really nice. Yeah, sure. I grabbed one of the pamphlets laid out on the desk. Oh, yeah, they really did. Something like this will definitely help people take the club more seriously. Yeah, I thought so, too. I flipped through the pages. Each member's poem is, really ne is neatly printed on its own page, giving an almost professional feel. I recognize Natsuki's and Yuri's poems from the ones they performed during our practice. What's this? I flipped to Sayori's poem. It's different from the one she practiced. It's one that I haven't read before. Get out of my head, get out of my head, get out of my head. Oh. My. God. Get out of my head before I do what I know is best for you. Get out of my head before I listen to everything she said to me. Oh no, you're talking about what Monica said. Oh no, get out of my head before I show you how much I love you. Get out of my head before I finish writing this poem. But a poem is never actually finished. It just stops moving. No, I need to get back to her house like right now. Ah, uh, what is this? Reading the poem, I get a pit in my stomach. Yeah, run. Run, you little shit. Psych? What's wrong? Oh, nothing. The poem feels... How did you not notice? Oh, my God. Does she not care? Every... <laughs> More than that, I, I changed my mind. I'm going to get Sayori, so... Ah, uh, well, all right. Try not to take too long, okay? Oh, my God. Fucking run. Don't strain yourself, Monica calls out to me. Oh my god, I quickened my pace. Run, run, you piece of fuck. What was I thinking? I should have tried a little bit harder for her. It's not a big deal to at least wait for her to wake her up, isn't it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Even the simple gesture of waking... Oh my god, guys. I'm not, I'm not prepared. Is something going to happen and I'm not going to be prepared? Oh my god. Okay. Besides, I told her yesterday that things will be the same as they always have been. That's all she needs. That's all I want to give her. I reach to Sayori's house and knock on the door. I don't expect an answer since she's not picking up her phone either. Like yesterday, I opened the door and let myself in. Sayori? She really is a heavy sleeper. No, she's not. You little fucker. Get the fuck upstairs. You swallow. Uh-huh. I don't. I can't believe I ended up doing this after all. Waking her up in her own house. 
This is really something a boyfriend would do, isn't it? In any case, I, it just feels right. Outside Sayori's room, I knock on her door. Sayori? Wake up, dummy. There's no response. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't show me. Oh, don't show me. Is it... Is it... Don't... Oh, my God. I gently open the door. Oh, no! No! Sayori, why? Why? How could you leave me like this? Okay, that's creepy. Oh my god, I'm... F what the fuck? An exception has occurred. The file, game, flash slash script, siege, line CO 307. See traceback text for details. What the fuck? What the hell? That's what I was saying! Is this a nightmare? It has to be. This isn't real. There's no way this can be real. Sayori wouldn't do this. Everything was normal up until a few days ago. That's why I can't believe my eyes are showing me. No. Vomit, dude. No. Resuscitate her, please. Do something. Yeah, you told Sayori you'd be there for anywhere and ever. Oh, no. Why? Why would you do this? How could I be so helpless? What did I do wrong? Confessing to her? I shouldn't have confessed to her. Oh, stop blaming yourself. That's not what Sayori needed at all. She even told me how painful it is for others to care about her. Then why did I confess to her and make her feel even worse? Why was I so selfish? Oh my god, what if I didn't say I love you? What if I did friends on her? Would she be still be alive? No! This can't be happening! Oh god. If I just spent more time with her, walked her to school, and remained friends with her like it always had been, then I could have prevented this. I know I could have prevented this. I could have screwed the literature club, screwed the festival. That's right! I just lost my best friend. Wow, okay. Um, Yeah, that's really dark. <coughs> Someone I grew up with, she's gone forever now. Nothing I can do can bring her back. Oh, this isn't some game where I can reset and try something different. I can reset and try something different. Huh. I wonder. Huh. Huh. Alright, let's try this. What? File error. Character. Sayori. CHR. The file is missing or corrupt. The save file is corrupt. Starting a new game. What? Why? Why is it starting a new game? Whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck? What does that mean? Who is... I see an annoying... That's supposed to be Sayori. What the fuck? The girl is... What? And our good neighbor... Hello? You know, the kind of friend you never see yourself making? Known each other for so long? Oh my god, what? This is... I've read all of this before. What the fuck? However, just sign... Uh, let her... What? What the fuck? Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? It's an ordinary school day, like any other. Uh, what? Mornings are usually the worst, being surrounded by couples and friends, groups, walking to school together. Meanwhile, I've always walked to school alone. Wait, what? You have not always walked to school alone, you fucking liar. You've walked to school with Sayori. What the fuck is going on? What the fuck? Is there anything? Oh my god, what the fuck? I always tell myself it's about time to meet some girls or something like that, but I have no motivation to join any clubs. Oh my god. So this is slightly different. But... Sayori's gone. She's gone! What? How? You can't just... Okay, It's it was bad enough that she died, but it's worse now that... Okay, I got... Uh, I got it's bad enough that she, that she was killed, but it's worse now that she's deleted, because it's like, that's the memory of her? She's, she's gone! What the fuck? I can't... My character can't even fucking mourn? What the hell? Clubs. There's really aren't any that interest me. Proud to manding. Yeah, start with anime club. Psych. Oh, what the f what? Jesus. 
What, Monica? What the fuck? You were you were literally glitching out a second ago. I totally didn't expect to see you here. It's been a while, right? Yeah, I guess it has. Monica smiles sweetly. We do know each other. We rarely talk, but you were the one that was talking shit to Sayori. You were the one that was implanting ideas in her head. I blame you, you fucker. Probably most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. Out of my... Okay, I've read all of this. I've read all of this. Except... Weird. It's not... It, I, I didn't see her until I got to the club, you know? Supplies for my club. Do you know if there's any construction paper in here? Or markers? Oh, no. Sayori and I were supposed to be looking for that. You're in the debate club? About that, I should quit the debate. Yeah. You're in the literature club now. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe this is actually happening. What the fuck am I doing? Oh no. You're starting in. Oh, whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck was that? Literature club? Yeah, fuck your literature club. Yeah, it's really fucking dull because Sayori is no longer there. Fuck you. Fuck your club. Oh my god. How many members have you have so far? Um. Huh. It's kind of embarrassing, but there are only three of us so far. It's really hard to find new members for something that sounds so boring. Well, I can see that. But it's really not boring at all, you know? Literature can be a bit... Of a oh, my God. I've read this part before. Yeah, I've read this before. Oh, my God. I mean, she's not wrong. That's not right. You know, I had a sneaking suspicion I should copy the game files and store another copy um, of certain game files somewhere. I wonder if that would have worked. Besides, the members are member, right? Did Monica say she? Hmm, okay, so this is this is still the same thing. But now, I'm just in a nightmarish nightmarish fucking nightmare! A nightmarish nightmare! Of without Sayori. My best friend. Oh no, no, my best friend. How could how could this be like, how could this be happening? Oh my god. Awesome, you really sweet psych, you know that? Oh my god, no, fuck that. I just, where's Sayori to convince me? She's the only reason I went. F what? And thus I sold my soul to Monica and her irresistible smile. Uh that, I'm pretty sure that was a little different, but Jesus, that's creepy. Timidly follow Monaco upstairs. Third year activities. Open a classroom door. What the fuck? Oh, oh, oh. I wasn't the only one that saw that, right? Everyone else saw that too. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? Brought a guest with me. What the? This is a. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Jesus fucking Christ! Scared the shit out of me. A guest? Seriously? You brought a boy? Way to kill the atmosphere. Don't be mean, Nitsuki. But anyway, welcome to Club Psych. Where's Sayori? This club is full of incredibly... Yes. Whatever. You're Monica's boyfriend, right? What? No, I'm not. Nitsuki. Girl with the sour attitude is whose name is apparently Nitsuki. Okay, yeah. This is the, all the same stuff. It's all the same stuff. Yuri's the vice president. No, you can never replace Sayori. Now I have you both on my watch list. Mm. Seems to have a hard time keeping up with someone like that. Oh my god. So I ran in a psych in the classroom and he decided to come check. I am not. This is. The jump scares are not okay. They're not okay. On top of everything that I'm going through, not okay. I don't have time to register this. I don't have time to do this. Oh my god, I wasn't going to, well, you know. Sorry, sorry. I didn't forget about it, but I just happened to run into him. In that case, oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on. What the fuck? Uh, I'm, I'm just checking a file here. Oh my god. <sighs> yep, still gone. What the fuck? Yeah, that would be great. Why don't you come sit down, psych? Of course, I have a few desks arranged. Oh my god. This is all this is all the same stuff. This is all the same stuff that I've gone through in the other episodes. You uh, Okay, as president of literature, I have my duty to make club 
Ever fun for everyone. I'm surprised there aren't more people in the club yet. It must be hard to start a new club. You can put it that way. Yep, yep, pretty much. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is this is terrifying. I guess. Natsuki reluctantly agrees. Interest in the same goal. Oh. It's not finding these three, it's finding these two. Carrying a tea set. Uh, don't worry, the teachers gave us permission. Oh my god, I guess. Don't let yourself feel me. Oh my god. Insulted your elix away. I meant that, you know. Uh, I am. I am. I. Sorry, I just gotta get this out of me real quick. I hate this game. I'm glad. Yeah, you're glad that I hate this game. Yeah, well, fuck you. Fuck you. You're not Sayori. You're, in, you're the reason, one of the reasons I hate her. You shouldn't have fucking pushed yourself on me. It's such a... Yeah, whatever. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know what to say, guys. I... I thought that... If it that the way that things were going with the poems that I'd be able to if we got into a horror scenario, I'd be able to save her since I liked her the most. But apparently fuck that God. Oh my god. I guess everything's the same. I'm I'm just gonna keep going. Can I skip? I can't skip. This is this Psychological. <laughs> Deliberately take advantage of your own lack of imagination to completely... Yep, I was thrown for a loop, alright. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is creepy as fuck. I'm looking at the files again. There's a super creepy ass picture of... It's a PNG. It's called Happy Thoughts. With the A's... The, the A and the O replaced with X's. And it's really fucking creepy. I'm just looking for something. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> this is terrifying. Oh boy. I'm looking at all these files, man. Ah, oh, that's ridiculous. A lot of horror. Yeah. Oh my god. I, was, I still can't can't get over the fact that Siri's gone. Oh my god. Oh, and it was terrifying. I have nightmares from that shit. Oh, is that so really? I don't really give a fuck because the most important character is already dead. Oh my god. All because of this demon lady on the right. Ah! Mm. 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 My god, all this is the same. It's all the same. It's all the same. Oh my god. What are we even doing here? Why am I going still? What am I going on for? Oh my god, I'm terrified. I really hope that there's a way to fix this. Oh my god. Uh... Not happy. Oh, I'm not happy. Not happy. 
Oh god. Oh wait, 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 what was that? We don't have enough members yet to form an official club. Okay, but the, we need four. Oh, this is a little different. You can't tell me this. This is new stuff. Sayor used to be the fourth member. Been trying really, really hard to find new members. If you don't find one for a festival, I'm defenseless. Am I supposed to make a clear headed decision when it's like this? I am not sure I like this. I am pretty damn upset. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so this is all the same. This is all the same still. Oh my god. Please don't jump scare me again. I can't I can't handle that right now. Everyone remember tonight's assignment. Write a poem to bring the next meeting so we can all share. Okay. 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 Can I really impress the class? Oh boy. Uh, okay. See you tomorrow. Yeah, you fucking demon. Thought I'd depart the club room and make my way home. The whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between three girls. Natsuki, Yuri... And of course, Monica. Uh, yeah, no, fuck them, Sayori. Sayori's were... Oh, man. We need Sayori. Perhaps I'll have the chance to go cruise. Oh, I was really hoping we could go with Sayori. Alright. I just need to make the most of my circuit. Yep. I already said that. You have unlocked a special poem. Would you like to read it? Um, okay, this is new, sure. A joke. A man walked into a club. In the club, there was a girl who liked him very much. They spent some time together, and then she liked him even more. One day, the girl realized she was in love with him. Before disaster could happen, a third party intervened with her programming. Suddenly, the girl hated herself for being in love. This contradiction caused the script to derail. The universe started to collapse, but she killed herself just in time. What? What? That's... Fuck you, game. Fuck you. This is... This, this poem is a joke. It is a joke. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, well, I'm going to have to end the episode here, guys. I'm running out of time. Thank you all so much for watching, and thank you for your support. This is really freaking me out. i uh not sure what to do from here. I don't even know if I, I want to continue. Maybe I, I could try to see if I could get Sayori's file back and put her back in characters. I mean, maybe that'd do something? I don't know. Fuck my life. Uh, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to hit the like button. If you didn't like it, hit the like button anyway. Leave a comment on what you thought I could do better. Subscribe for more content. Share this with your friends. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.